Hey guys, welcome to part three of Warrior Cats. So, it has been a second since I recorded this because the last two videos you saw, I recorded like three weeks ago, maybe two weeks. Um, and then I just cut it in half. So, I'm still trying to work out what a good length is for this. Uh, yeah. So, I say we just dive right into it. <laughs> uh, the notes are, of course, always going to be on the side here, so every, so you all can keep track of what's happening. Um, so I'll just be writing on that while we go. Uh, wow, right paw is fighting with wild path. That is really interesting. Why? Everybody's very protective of what of right paw, so maybe wild path is being extra protective of right paw, which is might be pissing her off a bit. Uh, that could be why they're fighting currently. Willow Beam is talking to themselves, so we should keep an eye on him. Make sure he doesn't go too crazy. Uh, what? That is so interesting. So, Slight Breeze is developing a crush on Patch Splash. I mean, I think she might be a bit old for her. Well, they're not terrible. Only 15 moons apart. Maybe we'll send them on patrol together, see how that goes. Uh, let's start sending some people on patrol. So let's send out Patch Splash and Slate Breeze and see if anything happens. So, a kitty pet is interested in joining. Hmm. We have a responsible and we have an adventurous. Hmm. I think they would not want... This is kind of like a date, so I don't think they would want a kitty pet to join in on their date. <laughs> uh, we're going to send, I guess, these two out together? I don't know. With that one. Okay. A rogue. Careful, sneaky. They have bright paw, and I really don't think they're going to risk bright paw. They are so protective of her, so I don't think they would do that. Sneaky, wise, confident. Ooh, they're great fighters and not really necessarily great hunters, so I don't know if they would be super into the idea of crossing. Like, I don't think they would gain anything from it, but we do have a very confident one and we do have a very sneaky one. Hmm, I'm going to leave it for now. All right, so we are going to move on to the next day here. What is this? What is this? Yellow Shade just had a litter of two kits. What? <laughs> I know she's always kind of had a motherly instinct helping raise J Spot and Bright Paw, but I didn't realize that meant that she wanted to have kits of her own. She just had two girls Brook Kit and Gold Kit. Wow. <laughs> wow. I, I, I cannot believe these developments. <laughs> we have. Two new kids now. I that that's crazy to me. <laughs> All right. Wow. Okay. Interesting. So how's everybody feeling today? Uh, daydreaming. Hopes they will do battle training soon. I think this goes to show that Bright Paw is like, stop freaking babying me. I'm fine to go out on my own. Let me live. Uh, Flystar is having a hard day. Patch Splash is watching over the kids. Feeling happy, lazy, is giving Bright Paw some advice. Alright. Big brother J Spot is giving his little sister some advice. Probably about the battle training and being like, I know you feel annoyed that everyone's babying you, but maybe it's for the best. And she's like, No, it's not. It's not J Spot. You are an idiot. And he's like, Well, that's very rude. <laughs> so I don't know what's gonna happen there let's be a warrior with brook kit and is having a hard day and bat kit thinks they're going crazy well your your name is bat kit it kind of makes sense that you'd go bat shit you know <laughs> all right let's start some patrols um let's bring bright paw and j spot out maybe large rat Ooh, they missed the rat that's no good 
Uh, we're not going to be sending Yellowshade out because she is a queen currently, so she's just going to chill out for a bit. Um, we'll send... Well, I don't know. Maybe Slave Breeze and Patch Splash want to go out again? Hair? Catches the hair? See? They're going well together. They really are working as a good team, aren't they? And then let's bring these three out. Ooh, Fox. Sneaky, sneaky, and wise. Okay, they're good. <laughs> a bit worrying there for a second, but they're good. Um, I don't really have anything else to do, so let's move on to Moon 7. Bright Shade has earned their warrior name, and Batpaw has started their apprenticeship. Everyone's moving up in the world. Okay, here is Batpaw currently, and here is Bright Shade. Um, she kind of has a very ironic name, doesn't she? Bright Shade. Uh, it's fine, it's fine. Uh, it's kind of funny. So, who's your mentor? Slight Breeze! Slight Breeze is mentoring Batpaw. Well, that's... I would say that's a pretty good partnership. Yep, yep. I, I would agree. I think Slight Breeze would work well. So, let's maybe go bring them out. And maybe Patch Flash would take a look. Patch Blast suggests this would be a good chance for the cats to practice teamwork. I would agree. Nobody steps up to teach. That's a thing against you guys getting together, I'll be honest. <laughs> Seems like yesterday we were working well together, today, eh, not so much. Um, I think Bright Shade, now that she is finally gotten her warrior name, would <laughs> go out on her own. Be like, screw you people, you baby me way too much, I'm a full-blown warrior, I can deal with it. Uh, she is smart and compassionate. I don't think she would smell it. <laughs> She's smart and compassionate. Doesn't make sense to me. Speaking of traits, bat paw is thoughtful, which is very interesting. Uh, thoughtful bat paw, which kind of conflicts with the whole going crazy. I did forget to look at their traits, but it doesn't really seem like many are doing much lately. No. Rook Kit really does want to be a warrior though I he she she yeah she she's uh pretending to be a warrior right now and yellow shade keeps smelling some warrior speaking of enemy warriors when we get this I'm going to in in the future not yet because I'm a bit lazy but we are going to create some random generators that will I will spin when we get things like this so that we can get some interesting scenarios that our cats are going to have to sort their way through uh oh i did not mean to i did not mean to send out yellow shade she's still a queen that was a mistake i'm sorry we'll send these guys out and they missed the rat that's no good to be honest nothing significant happens all right all right um how's everyone feeling why the fact is that feeling down why why are you feeling down my girl? why are you feeling down my girl Pounce Lilac is tripping over Brook Kids. <laughs> kind of funny to me. <laughs> Aw, <Aww>, baby. <laughs> and this could mean that Brook Kid might be a bit angry. Might be a bit angry at Pounce Lilac. Patch Flash is acting suspicious. Is Could that be because Patch Flash is developing... Trying to gain the confidence to ask Slight Breeze out as her mate, perhaps? Could be, could be. Uh, because, you know, Patch Splash has been thinking about love. Slight Breeze has developed a crush. It only makes sense that that's why they she's acting a bit suspicious. Oh, and Slight Breeze thinks they're going crazy. I don't think they actually think they're going crazy. I think this is more so just them being like, why the hell is Patch Splash acting like that? <laughs> Am I going crazy? They seem very odd recently. Oh, Gold Kit whines about being hungry. That's not good. Do we not have enough food in camp? Yikes. All right, we're going to send out... All right, got some fresh kill. Well, Bright Shade is feeding. <laughs> She's feeding Gold Kit right now. Um, I... Hmm. See, I'm going to send Bat Paw out with... 
Why Star? I think maybe Slight Breeze was like, I need to talk to Patch Splash about why the heck they're acting like that. Could you maybe give, you know, Bat Paw some training <laughs> for now? Ooh, a kitty pet. I could, I could, I could see Fly Star wanting to uh, invite them, but he, he, he ends up scaring them away. <laughs> Aw. Alright, well, that's fine. <laughs> I know J Spot. Um, J Spot would not invite people out. Uh, Wild Path. Let's send these two out together. Ooh. Um, they're not pursuing that dog. No, thank you. Let's send these two out together. The patrol starts dieting. Dieting. Doubting Slight Breeze's ability as clan deputy. Ah. <gasps> What? Patch Splash? Okay, maybe the suspiciousness is like, they're kind of screwing it up a bit. I would think Slight Breeze is kind of misinterpreting what Patch Splash is thinking. And Patch Splash is just terrible at explaining herself. So I think that's what happened. Not so much that they're actually doubting. It's just that's what um, Slight Breeze thinks is happening. So we're going to do... I don't know. We're gonna do, I think, two more moons. We'll get to moon 10, and then I think we'll end. Um, still nothing happens. Bit disappointing. <laughs> Wild Path is feeling nervous. Right, Shay is having a hard day. Lyster is hoping for a sign from Star Clan. Daydreaming, when we're in camp. Nervous. See? Nervous to build up the confidence. I think, I think today's the day. I think Patch Wash is gonna go up to Slight Breeze and be like, hey, all right? I'm Sorry for what happened yesterday. You completely misinterpreted me. I did not mean to doubt you as a leader. I think you're a great deputy. And honestly, I was nervous, not because you're a bad deputy and I didn't trust you, but because I want to be your mate. And I think Slight Breeze would say, hell yeah. <laughs> so they're now mates, which is adorable. Alrighty, so I guess we're going to send out... Slight Breeze, Patch Splash, and Bat Paw. Again. Oh. It's all cold now. That makes me sad. <laughs> to be honest, it makes me sad. I don't like seeing it all cold and icy. Uh, Yellow Shade was looking forward to today, so maybe that means that she wants to actually go out of camp. But we're gonna not. For now. <laughs> we're gonna not. Maybe we'll send Flystar up just alone. And Bright Spot, Bright Shade, and J Spot are gonna go out together. Um, hmm. I, I don't know. J Spot is pretty confident. He would just go up and sniff it. The patrol interprets the purpose of the object. Well, that's good to hear. And then lastly, we'll send these two out together. A rogue. Ooh, Wild Path got a scar from a rogue. That is a bit unnerving, I'll be honest. Uh, last moon of today. Let's see what happens. Uh, what? 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 <laughs> oh my god. What just happened? I, I, I was like, all right, last moon. Probably nothing's gonna happen again. And 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 then why oh, Star died in an accident at 85 moons, but not before he ended up having a litter of two kits. And Slight Star has now become Slight Breeze is now Slight Star. With the clan having no deputy. <laughs> oh my god. And Fly Star is proud of Slight Star. I. I. I have no words. I simply have no words. 
So here's what I think happened, okay? I think Flystar may have been out on patrol and he came across two kits and they were being attacked by a very dangerous dog and it was coming at them and Flystar in the heat of the moment just sprinted in and saved the kits costing him his life but the kits got back to the camp and well, I am sh oh my god slight star is now the leader of the clan who would become slight star's deputy though part of me is like yellow shade maybe he's careful and extremely smart um I don't think Patch Splash would want to become deputy. And neither would these two, I don't think. J Sp I feel like it's probably between J Spot and Yellow Shade. Although Wild Path has in the past wanted to become a leader. Because on the first day Wild Path was talking to Flystar about leadership, so Perhaps Wild Path does want to become deputy? Which is interesting. I'm, I might just promote her. Because I feel like, I don't know, Yellow Shade's not particularly young. Although Yellow Shade's never really had much of an interest, it seems. I think we're going to promote Wild Path to deputy. Right. This has been quite the change. <laughs> I'm... I am simply stressed. <laughs> so, Wild Path is talking to themselves. Bright Shade is already thinking about kits. Bat Paw is volunteering for the Dawn Patrol, so I think she's really into her studies. Like, she really wants to become a warrior and help the clan, which is very good of her. Um, gold Kid is rethinking their life choices at four moon gold. <laughs> Jesus. Uh,. And Yellow Kid is becoming interested in herbs, which might mean that Yellow Kid would might prefer to become a medicine cat instead. And Flystar is proud of Slight Breeze, so I think he's pretty proud that she stepped up and took the leadership role, despite the grief she would probably be feeling with Flystar's departure. Alright, I don't know how much Slight Star would actually want to go out on patrol. I think she might want to just get back into life. <laughs> uh, yeah. So I think Patch Splash is probably going to take Bat Paw out instead. Adventurous and thoughtful. Oh, damn it. See, here's the problem. <laughs> here's the problem. Pat Splash. <sighs> He's adventurous and he definitely want to cross. But he, would he put would he put Bat Paw in harm's way? I don't know. A part of me thinks he might. Oh damn it! I'm gonna regret this. Patch Flash is hip and retires the elder den. I knew I'd regret it. He's she's paralyzed. Oh my god! This is why you don't let your adventurousness get in the way of your head <laughs> all right oh my god okay bat paw might take that to heart and be like oh my god i'm terrified of monsters now <laughs> that's horrible slight breeze her her friend that she's known for the longest time just died and then her mate just got paralyzed like what the heck <laughs> What is happening in this clan? All right, so the day is done uh, after many strange instances. <laughs> anyway, I'm gonna I'm gonna leave this episode here. Thank you all for watching. I will see you guys at some point in the future, near future. Don't worry. Uh, so yeah.